Hey guys, Brickover here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to build Lego uh, Dr. Eggman, Dr. Robotnik from Sonic the Hedgehog, because uh, my How to Build Sonic the Hedgehog characters were very popular, and who am I to complain about getting a bunch of views? This is because you guys really liked all those uh, videos. Over 100 views on the channels, thank you very much for that. And without further ado, let's get into the parts. Alright guys, these are all the parts that you'll need for his body. This is like a curved one. And those are bricks. Those are uh, flat ones. And then a uh, 2x2 two two or with a 1x2 on top of it will work for this brick. Uh, I recommend cheese slopes, but you can do uh, having them together. Uh, these are bricks. Uh, flat and then bricks, tile, and then flat again. It's kind of hard to tell with the color difference or whatever because of the lighting. Uh, but those are like a darkish yellowish orange. Um, and yeah, let's get right into the build. All right, now for starting with his feet, you're gonna need the brick. Uh, you can use this one with the studs on the back, or just a 2x2 two two with the 1x2 on it, and then you're going to take your cheese slopes, put them on there, and then you're going to take your 1x2 bricks, stack them together, put them on there, and then you're going to take this part, take a brick, and then you're going to want to take, uh, I'm taking it off the base plate while doing this. Uh, take the 1x2s and put them onto there. So if, if you hear a brick separator rattling around on them, then that's why. Uh, and then you can put that on there, and that's his pants. And you're going to take 2x4, and then you're going to take 1x4s, or you can put them as a 2x2, two two, and move it a little bit closer. And you're going to take the 1x4, and then this curved brick, right there. And then, uh, this is the part for his arms. You're going to take this brick. Um, yeah, I really should have uh, just taken them. Uh, cut away to when they're taken off. Alright, they're taken off. And now, you take this brick. And then you take the tiles. Stupid camera won't focus. Uh, take the one by one tiles from there. Then you're gonna take your one by one bricks. Focus, Mr. Camera. Uh, okay, let's leave it at that for settings. Uh, and then sack them like that for his arms. And then you can put them on like that. Put those on there for his arms. And then for his gloves, he's got like uh, gold cuffs, I believe, from the reference photo that I used. Um, you're just going to stack these uh, pieces on like that and attach them there for that. And, uh,. Uh, I think Eggman is probably one of my favorites because he's more complicated. Like the others are kind of like uh, base alterations of one another. And so that's his body. Now we'll get into using his head. Um, I am going to mention that the bottom, uh, I used a 1x2 there, uh, but you can use a 2x4 there. I just didn't have the pieces for that. So, I'm going to lay out the parts for what you need to make it. Alrighty, I'm back, and uh, as you can see, here are all the bricks you'll need. I have, like, combined some of them to show uh, that I, like, substituted them. So, I used two 2x2s. Two uh, these are supposed to be 2x4s, but I just ended up using a bunch of uh, flat pieces. And 1x2 flat, so 1x4 uh, bricks, or 2x1x2 bricks, uh, curve one, 
silver stud, uh, clear. You could use blue if you wanted, like, blue goggles for, like, flat round tiles. Uh, four few slopes, or you can have uh, uh, combined pieces like that, and then you'll need two brown ones, and uh, the red one is just because it kind of went like in back. So that's all the pieces you'll need. Let's get right into it. All right, so you're gonna want to take your first hand two by four or a uh, horrible mess uh, for me, and then you're gonna take and put one by two, put it on top there, and then you're going to take one by two brown, and put them to either side, and then you're going to keep it all together with one brick there, and then you're going to stack these two here, I have instantly hurt your fingers. Let me just do that to make it even more painful. And I'll stop now, because I can tell you're in pure agony. And you're going to make sure, if you have it all messy like me, that you're going to want to make sure that it is all straight. And by now, you should have it mostly straight. Now, you're going to want to take the brown cheese slopes, and put it on there, and you've made his mustache. Then you're going to want to go to the top of his head and build it in segments. Take your 2x4 or bricks, 2x2 two two bricks, then take your cheese slopes or your uh, long push 1x2 sloped, and you're going to assemble it like that. Then you're going to take your 2x2, plop it up there, and you're going to take your 2x2 two two tile and put it on top for his top. Now let's get into the visor. You're going to want to take these. You will The design that I came up with, you're going to want them like this. And you're going to take your 2x4, or again, mess of pieces for me. And you're going to put them like that. And then you're going to take these bricks. Uh, they've got the, like the snot bricks. Studs not on top, even though there are studs on top. So acronym, acronym, the acronym doesn't make much sense. Now does it? And then you're going to take the jumper plates. Oh, not the camera, but, and you're going to put those on top or on the side, facing forward. And then you're going to make the goggles. So you're going to want to take the silver studs and put them there. And then put the clear round bits on there. And then for the back, and you can just put the head on top. Then you're like, great, but there's a big gaping hole in the back of his head. And that's where this comes in, because I actually used it, and then it was like, didn't really go as planned, because I didn't have one-sided snap bricks. So, then I came up with this design, which, while yes, there is a bit of a gap right there, it does look overall pretty good, I'd say. Because you can put that in the back. Go on. And as you can see, it's actually rounded off a bit nicely. So then you can take his body and pop his head on top, and that is how you make Lego Dr. Eggman from Sonic the Hedgehog slash Dr. Robotnik. Thank you for watching, I do appreciate it, uh, and yeah, this is because this video came out because you guys really showed a bunch of support for the past videos, so see you in the next one, goodbye guys.